Well, I'm super excited and there's a good reason behind it. Not because my hair is completely screwed up, um, because I got another mower. Look at this thing. It's a Cub Cadet. I don't know how many horse it is. It's probably, now that I think about it, it actually might be an 18. I told the guys it was 16, but 18, 10, it's probably a 18 horse. And I don't know what kind of engine. It could be a Kohler, it could be an owner, it could be a, I don't know, maybe they've even put a Briggs and Stratton in this thing. Highly, highly doubtful though. But uh, yeah, guess how much? Free! They just gave it to me, which is awesome because the first mower, you know, I got for free. Now I'm getting this one for free. But uh, just like the other mower, I'm going to take up the parts that I don't use and give them back so then they can scrap them. So, uh, Brant Automotive Parts gave me that. This is up in Brant. They buy scrap and, you know, sell parts for trucks and cars and stuff. So, if you ever need a uh, car part or something, you can go up there. And uh, I really appreciate it. This is going to be sweet. It looks like shit right now, but hey. I can fix just about anything, in my opinion. So, uh, yeah, that's what I'm going to be working on all day. Just trying to put this engine on that, that um, mower in there and take all that other junk off that other mower and, and try to get as far as possible because I only got 15 days. I'm at a disadvantage. So right now I'm going to take the deck off of this thing and then probably the engine and then probably the transmission and stuff and uh, then we'll just go from there and see how that engine from the Cub Cadet uh, fits on here and if we have to we can bring the ass end out a little bit more or shrink the seat in more or whatever and uh, yeah we'll just do a little at a time I mean taking the deck off and the engine off is probably going to take like an hour or two but it won't seem like that for you guys because I'll edit it and you know only make it 10 seconds long Well, getting that uh, deck and axle off only took me about 20 minutes. Hopefully that engine will be real quick too. I think it's going to be awesome. And then if I have to, I can like move this, move these things so like you twist them around 90 degrees, then we got more uh, more space right here to mount an engine. It'll work slack. And uh, free belts every second. And they don't even look that bad. They're just they just got surface rust on them from you know metal on the belt. But now I'm gonna take the transmission off. Well, I got that uh, transmission out. It's laying right there by the engine. Got the battery out. Got that on the charger. That'd be awesome if uh, the battery was good. That uh, turbo start. Never heard of it, it's right junk. <laughs> Anyways, um, it's looking pretty sweet. It's just, um, I don't know what I'm gonna do with the seat yet. I would really like to have it real low, along with the steering wheel, have that low. So uh, that would that might prevent me from having to widen out the tires. But uh, I think the first thing I should do is get the engine on here and see what it's going to look like before I go any farther. So, we're probably going to have to take that lawnmower out and take the engine out of it. Okay, so we uh, got the engine out. Uh, that was a little bit harder than I expected. Uh, there was two bolts here that uh, you you had to stop the, the one side of the bolt. And there's frick, the steering mechanisms right there, so you can't even get to it. So... We had a we had a you know a trouble getting it, but the engine's right here, so we got it out. Um, it looks like we're I'm gonna have to weld something right here, so that you know it's not louder as hell. But it's gonna be sweet though, because that's how the engine's gonna sit. You know, the clutch is gonna be right here. That's what I'm gonna use for my clutch, and you know the flames come out that, and that'll be sweet. So uh, yeah, just gonna just gonna clean it up and uh, get it running. <laughs> 